Many years ago, Israel was ruled by leaders called judges. One of these judges, named Samson, was the strongest man who ever lived. Are you okay, Samson? Mm. Yes, mother. Okay, son. His strength had been given to him in a very special way. Thanks for helping, Samson. Sure, Dad. I need to go home now. Delilah is expecting me. Son, I'm not so sure I approve of this Delilah of yours. After all, she's a Philistine, Samson. Mother, Delilah's very sweet. Samson, don't ever forget that you have a trust. Yes, Mother, I know. It is a secret trust given, given to, to you, you by God. I remember. Sometimes you let yourself be influenced by others. You must never reveal the trust, the secret of how God makes you strong. Hey, son, just one more thing before you go? Sure. Don't worry, I'll never tell the secret of my strength. Samson did not know, however, just how hard it would be to keep the trust. This is the story of Samson and Delilah. Delilah, I'm home. Roderick, I thought I put you in charge of hanging the pennons. I'm afraid that I'm at the mercy of my help. Dex, I thought you were going to paint the pennants in a pattern. Red, yellow, red, yellow. Don't ask me. Wally's using the Color by Antony paint sprayer. I think I got the hang of it now. <laughs> mm, just what we need. Another contraption by Antony. Operated by a colorblind caterpillar. Oh, I'm not colorblind, but I am double jointed. Watch. Wally, I wouldn't. Want to see me pat my head and rub my tummy? No. Wally, don't make me do all the work by my. <laughs> Well, at least the other parts of the Founder's Day celebration are off to a good start. Uh, weren't you going to put the pennants up? No, my dear ant friend. We decided they looked better on the ground. Why don't you use my newly invented Antony pennant stapler and poster hanger? <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Fortunately for me, I have a tough outer shell. Sorry, Roderick. I must need adjusting. And so does your talent as an inventor. Hey, my inventions work. Most of the time. Hey, I'm only joking. You ready to go root hunting? Yeah, all right. Now remember, for the Bucklesville stew, we need a large red root. Megan, relax. I know right where it grows. Okay, but we've got to start cooking this stew right away. It takes days to cook, you know. Don't worry. We'll be back faster than a bee to honey. See you later. Iggy, you're a bee. What gave you that idea? Can you fly up and help Roderick attach the pennants? I do not need help from an Apis mellifera. Hey, somebody knows the scientific name for a bee. Apis mella what? Why couldn't they pick an easier name like, uh, uh Dex? Delilah! Delilah! she's off to now. Now let me get this straight. You want me to find out the secret of Samson's strength? 
Yes, Delilah. That's what we hope you will do for us. Yes, do for us. And why should I betray the man I love? Because you, like us, are a Philistine. Yes, a Philistine. Hmm. But you leaders of the Philistines are the sworn enemies of Samson. Not to state the obvious, but that's why we want the secret of his strength. We have never been victorious against him. Now, with you, <laughs> we have a chance. <laughs> a chance, yes. Ho <sighs> oh, hum. We offer 1,100 pieces of silver. The secret of Samson. You know he's promised his god never to tell. Well then, take another 1,100 pieces of silver. Yeah, take another 1,100 uh, 1, pieces of silver. Gentlemen? We have a deal. First, deliver us the secret so that we may capture your Samson. Then I shall be on my way. Stay close. I'll send a message to you soon. Anthony, now that we have the route, are you sure you remember the way back to Bogglesville? Absolutely. We just go right through these bushes. Dead end. No, it isn't. Bugglesville's right over this valley, just beyond that tall grass. We just have to get across. Then just how are we supposed to do that? I intend to hitch a ride. Huh? Oh, I thought you'd fly me over it. Fly? I don't know. Oh, don't worry. I'll be okay. Once I'm over, you can fly back and get the route. Ladybugs fly all the time. Ladybugs fly all the time. Ready? On three. Ladybugs fly all the time. Okay. One, two, wait! <laughs> Understand. Antony, if I explain it, I'll be telling you the biggest secret I have. Okay, what is it? No, really, this is a huge thing. Can I trust you? Sure you can, Gina. You can trust me. Well, the truth is, I can't fly. What? Do I have to say it again? But I thought all ladybugs could fly. We all can, it's just... I have a fear of flying. How can that be? When I was a little ladybug, I set a record for crashing into things and ended up losing my nerve to fly. Well, don't worry, Gina. Your secret's safe with me. I'll just come up with plan B. We'll, um, just backtrack the way we came. <laughs> no problem. Thanks, Antony. I know I can trust you. to see you. And I you, my love. I'm still worn out from battling the Philistines. I heard you won, as usual. 
yeah, this was a quick victory. Quick. Quick. I was just in the middle of a nap. Yes, you sleep, Samson. You need to rest. Samson, tell me the secret of your strength. Anyone ties me up with seven fresh vines that have never been dried. I'll be as weak as any other man. So go on. What happened after you two got lost? Perhaps Antony should invent something where he can't get lost, hmm? Speaking of getting lost, Roderick, why <laughs> don't... All that matters is that Antony got us home safe and sound. Yeah, well, except for when I fell off the cliff because Gina's too scared to... Oh! You fell off the cliff? <laughs> yeah, silly me. <laughs> Antony, you promised! Both sides of him. Hide in the other room. Wait for my signal. Yes, Eli. Oh. Samson, the Philistines are here. How dare they? Where? Delilah, why did you say the Philistines were here? Why didn't you tell me the truth about the secret of your strength? Delilah, my love, I've never told anyone that secret. I always make up some story about it. If you loved me, you would tell me. Delilah, I just can't. <laughs> Ah, uh, Delilah, I'm sorry. Don't cry. I didn't mean to trick you. Anthony, more heat! The stew's not cooking fast enough. Hmm, big surprise. Another Antony invention that doesn't work. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Leave Antony alone. He's trying the best he can. Sorry, Roderick. My aim was a little off. Antony, you haven't done one thing right today. Hey, that's not true. No, Roderick. Antony can't help it if his inventions don't always work. My inventions always work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it must be a Philistine warrior. <laughs> Oh, Samson. Here's some shade. Let's rest a while. Samson. What, Delilah? Now will you tell me the secret of your strength? Oh, Delilah. Do we have to talk about this now? Just tell me, and then we won't have to talk about it anymore. Well, if anyone ties me up, uh with new ropes that have never been used, then I'm as weak as uh, any man.
Samson, wake up! The Philistines are here! You lied to me again. Delilah, wait! Okay, so sometimes my inventions don't work. But everybody has faults. Speak for yourself. Come on, Roderick. Wally eats too much. Dex is a little dense. That one I'll give you. Maybe you're right. Sure I am. Spud uses words that are too big. Hey, Iggy can't fly straight. And Gino won't fly at all because she's too scared. What? Uh oh. Anthony, Megan said I couldn't swim in the creek. Yeah. <laughs> hey guys, listen, don't say anything about you mean about Gina. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Delilah, I'm sorry for tricking you again. But you know, I made a promise to my god not to tell my secret. I guess I understand. No, oh, Samson, do you know how to prove that you're sorry? Please, tell me. Go ahead and tell me the secret. It's my hair. Your hair? Yes. If you uh, weave my seven braids of hair uh, in, a, in a loom and tighten it, I'll, uh, I'll become as, as weak as any other man. Thank you, Samson. Samson, the Philistines are here! <laughs> Gina? Come on, Gina, please open the door. Huh? I need to talk to Gina. Seems like you've done enough talking already. She's really upset. I know. I shouldn't have told them about it, but it was bound to come out sooner or later. I think Gina's making too big a deal about this. You do? Yeah, I do. <laughs> Megan! Anthony, Gina gave you something very valuable, and you lost it. What? I didn't lose anything of hers. Oh, no? Well, she gave you her trust, and you seem to have lost that. Is it my fault that Gina won't fly? No. Why is everyone so mad at me? wrong with the giant? Oh. Delilah, I can't tell you my secret because I promised not to tell. It's a trust that I have been given. You can understand that, right? Trust. Megan's right. Gina gave me her trust, and I let my blabbing mouth get ahead of my friendship with her. I better go try to make things right. How can you say that you love me when you won't confide in me? This is the third time you've made a fool of me. It's my hair. I'm not falling for that one again. No, really. When I was born, God spoke to my mother and told her never to cut my hair. As long as my hair isn't cut, I have strength greater than any man. Really? Really. Oh, Samson, you're the best. <laughs> Admit the Anthony stew dispenser works like a charm. For now. Ahem. <laughs> Welcome to Bugglesville's Founders Day. Uh, it's the day when we remember how our great city was founded. 
I'll now read the speech that my great-great-grandfather gave when the town got started. He stood in the center of the new town and said these immortal words. I can fly! Why, honey, I thought you were too scared to fly. Well, I have a little help. It was good of you to apologize and then offer to help her. Hey, I always wanted to build an Anthony flight simulator. Go ahead with your speech, Mayor Green. Good use of the updraft. Now turn like I showed you. Yes. <clears throat> now, uh, where was I? Oh, yes. And he said these immortal words. We hereby start Bugglesville, a place where every bug can be themselves. Yay! Samson, the Philistines are here! <laughs> Delilah? Delilah! Samson was held captive by the Philistines. However, his hair did grow back, and as his hair returned, so did his incredible strength. As for Delilah, while she became rich with money, she lost her heart and happiness.